Hello, friends. I am Finish Lili. I am a chemical engineer. I am working in fields of typing for last 30 years. This video is part of my chemical process typing channel on YouTube. This video is about typing costs. The selection of the optimal pipeline who Diameter Material Wall thickness Pump station location Pump units and operational equipment or facilities is typically the result of economic analysis and investment capital evaluation of the most reasonable scenarios developed through the design phase. Typically, even before the detailed design of a pipeline system has begun, an order of magnitude cost study will be performed with the goal of determining the feasibility of continuing to invest time and capital in the design phase of the project. For a typical cross-country pipeline project, the cost of pipe and its associated construction and installation costs can be as much as 80 percent of the capital investment. Therefore, the selection of the pipe, with regard to the type of material, size, etc., is very important. A piping works engineer requires not only right engineering knowledge, not necessarily in depth, but certainly an understanding, but he must also have an understanding of engineering economics, costs of metallurgical methods of pipe fabrication, direction and sufficient knowledge of mechanical, civil, electrical and instrumentation engineering to discuss the requirement. Direct costs associated with piping. The direct cost of piping is related to the purchase and installation of piping along with accessories, i.e. it deals with all materials, labor, energy, etc. Indirect costs associated with piping, design and engineering costs, which cover the cost of design and cost of engineering of the piping system, purchasing, procurement and construction supervision, contractor's fees, technology fee, contingency allowance, this is an allowance to cover for unforeseen circumstances, labor disputes, design errors, etc. Economic evaluation of the piping system, as the purpose of investing money in modern piping system is to earn money, some means of comparing the economic performance of piping is needed. For a small piping system, and for simple choices between alternative processing schemes, the decisions can usually be made by comparing the capital and operating costs. More sophisticated evaluation techniques and economic criteria are needed when decisions have to be made between large, complex piping systems, particularly when the piping systems differ widely in scope, time scale etc. making major investment decisions in the face of uncertainties that will undoubtedly exist about plant performance, costs, but market government policy and the world economic situation is a difficult and complex task, if not an impossible task, and in a large design organization, the evaluation would be done by a specialist group. Inch meter and inch diameter concept the purpose of inch meter and inch diameter is to find out piping erection cost. You have to do manpower planning, pipe and work progress monitoring, costing. Consider the example. There are elbows of two inch size, 20 numbers. These are to be fitted in a pipeline. Find out the inch via. Inch via. Size X number of well joints X number of elbows equals to X to X 20 equals 80 inch via. Find out the inch meter for 20 meter pipeline of 2 inch size. Inch meter equals pipe size in inches X length in M equals to X 20 equals 40 inch meter. Inch meter will be different in case of yard piping. Long pipes lengths but less well. Well, that inch via will be more relevant in case of plant piping. Short pipe lengths, more wealth. Dividing the cost of the pipe work, the costs of process industry pipe work are usually subdivided as below. 
piping design and engineering materials, fabrication, direction, piping design and engineering. The cost of design work associated with the pipe work including layout studies, scheming, analysis and detailing. Materials. The cost of all bought out materials, that is pipe flanges, fittings, valves, expansion units, etc. Material estimation. There are three main topics of pipe work estimation. Preliminary, plus or minus 25%, based on percent age of total plant cost. First control, plus or minus 20% based on completed PNIDs, etc. Second control plus or minus 10%, final P and IB, all pipe work details, drawings, material list, etc. Fabrication, the costs can be divided as site fabrication, off site fabrication, done in a shop array and adjacent to site. Fabrication cost estimation. The contents of fabrication cost estimation comprise the following fabrication, rubbing, supports. Direction. The cost of erasing on site fabricated pipe work and pressure testing. This includes preliminaries, variation and escalation of orders, and error rectification if any. Direction cost estimation. The contents of fabrication cost estimation comprise the following direction supports. Testing of completed pipeline. Rates for fabrication and eruption. The schedule of rates under the fabrication and eruption work are established in man hours which should be representative of the gain time to complete the operation. The type of rate will depend on the client and contractor relationship on the basis of the contractor's tender. The rates shall be included or excluded. Allowances for construction plant, tools, tackle and consumables. Typical rates for various piping materials are enclosed for reference. These include labor, consumables, tools, tackles and overhead. Typical rates for fabrication, direction and testing of pipelines for costing with example, mild steel MSV and C class piping, rupees 45 per inch via per meter length, S300 for piping schedule 5, mars 90 per inch via per meter length, PVC piping, rupees 45 per meter length, copper piping, rupees 100 per inch via meter, Pipe fitting reducer, bend etc. SS 304, rupees 125 per inch via. MS, rupees 60 per inch via. Copper, rupees 140 per inch via. Fabrication and eruption of MS supports equals rupees 4500 per metric ton. General scope of work for piping fabrication and eruption. Fabrication, cutting, welding, assembly in position as per drawing. All non material, i.e., pipe, reducers, bends, trenches, sockets, etc., and hardware that is nut, bolts, gaskets, etc., shall be supplied by client. Fitment includes assembly of fittings, i.e., flanges, bends, valves, reducer, fabrication of teeth. Fitment of non-return valves, valves, gaskets, nut bolts, sockets or pressure gauges, fabrication and fitment of thermal, etc. Pipe work shall be carried out as per piping drawings slash specification slash instruction given to construction engineer. After assembly, complete pipeline to be welded by taking necessary precautions to avoid stresses. If stresses develop, those are to be removed and welded as per standard practice and instructions of the site coordinator. 
One in position well if allowed for lawn which cannot be welded on the ground. After welding, finishing and grinding, pipe line to be hydraulically tested at pressure specified in the order. After hydraulic testing, pipe line to be painted with red oxide one coat. After painting, pipe line to be assembled in position and with necessary clamps and supports. List of tools, tackles, and machinery required to carry out the piping works to be arranged by contractor, rectifier, HF unit, transformer, grinder, AG7, winch 5 metric ton, chain block 3 metric ton 11 meter lift, ropes and pulleys, SF to grinder. Hacksaw slash files, etc., and other tools and tackles. Pipe vise. GQ for grinder. Abrasive cutting machine. Gas cutting. Contractor manpower list of piping, fabrication and eruption. Experienced mechanical engineer as in charge. Supervisor. High skilled fitter for SS304. Highly skilled fitter for SB and C class piping and fabrication. Welders for SS TIG. Welders for SS Tacky. Welders for an S Tacky. Helper slash Eucharist. Additional cost information. Piping cost may vary between 20 to 66%. Piping cost may be a headache to the estimator as he slash she is asked to give the cost even before engineering and execution. The estimator needs to convert the preliminary flow sheet into a fair approximation of an actual design. The estimator should have the skill to draw quick and rather accurate freehand isometric sketches, which will be of an estimable value. Thanks for learning. If you like this video, please give a like to my channel and subscribe it.